uh, once again i was actually planning on doing a kind of vlog style thing uh, which i have been liking with another artist like i've seen many people do a uh, kind of a vlog uh, stuff but uh, then i uh, just thought of uh, putting my intro first and going on as usual uh, whatever i do with the other me videos of mine so coming back to the topic here i am actually doing a a pretty nice cute little sketch for an a page uh, that's on facebook it's called animal artist collective and it's also there on instagram so you can check that out it's a pretty nice page dedicated to um, animal conservation and artists who participate in uh, these animal artists collective uh, uh, donate a particular amount of their artwork or or the prints they sell online uh, to animal conservation and they contribute to some or the other way to animal conservation i i don't want to bore you guys bore you guys much with uh, stuff because i have actually uh, talked in much detail uh, into some of my previous videos so uh, maybe that's one reason why i don't want to uh, get into detail of animal artist collective it's a pretty nice initiative uh, for upcoming artists or artists who want to get into the i would say uh, uh, want to contribute uh, towards something and just overall get into the uh, i would say uh, want to do something with their artwork for animal conservation I think it's a pretty nice, uh, uh, I would say, page. And moreover, for me, it's it's just um, it's just a very nice way of. Uh, I don't know if I can even sell any of my artwork. I don't have any store. Uh, I mean, I have, but I don't have my own store. I have it on other websites, but uh, I'm hoping to start off. Uh, a new store this year uh, i'm being positive for that but for now i don't have my own store i have it on other website like uh, tea public and society 6 uh, so if you guys want you can get my art prints there or if you want a particular print uh, of uh, any of my artwork you see on youtube uh, you can comment down below and i'll i'll put that on the website or or i'll do something about it but for now so for now i just want to tell you how i uh, how i actually i am doing this uh, why i am painting an oak uh, it's called oak or grasshopper and why i am painting it because because of the fact that the topic for december month was oak uh, tree hopper and they are pretty nice creatures i mean they look uh, really cool and the colors it had were really nice it had like a pastely color which was really nice and i wanted to uh, wanted to paint insect for a really long time i have been painting uh, birds and animals and uh some of them have been appreciated by uh, the photographers from whose reference picture i've been painting and one of it was a really nice photographer like he was from a national geographic uh, channel I, i think i have uh, posted all the screenshots of them on my instagram page if you definitely want to check that out uh, whether that photographer have liked that picture of mine you can definitely check that on my instagram page i have it put up on my uh, like storyboard or the highlights you see so that was a really nice thing that happened in 2018 and and i really like uh and i really like that because it's kind of my achievement to like um doing something different so for this year i'm hoping uh, to get ahead on my channel and opening up a shop maybe maybe not i don't know but for now i think i i'll 
I'll pretty much do uh, as much as I can. So, uh, if you guys want to see an art style vlog or a vlog kind of uh, video, do let me know in the comment section below. I would love to do kind of that kind of stuff. Uh, I. I I have been interested in watching those kind of videos because uh, I do watch other YouTubers uh, or the YouTube artists do stuff like that that on YouTube and I have been admiring that a lot and just coming back to the uh, painting I'm doing here I am actually using gouache for the first time and I I should have mentioned it mentioned it uh, first but uh, I didn't I don't know how but uh, so wash it's a royal talent wash i i got it on my recent visit i've also uh, done a haul video uh, and i've shown it to you guys if you don't or you have if you haven't watched that video go and watch it because i, I did buy pretty much like new stuff there and uh, i have been i think i'm liking the way a wash turns out on watercolor paper and the watercolor paper I'm using here is, uh, I would say, Brustro uh, cold press paper in A5 size, I think. A5 or A3, the smaller one, smaller than A4. I always get confused which one is small. I think A5 is small. I think so. So that is the paper, and I I like using it because. Because of the fact that you don't get easily, like watercolor paper is not easily available uh, sometimes uh, for me because uh, people tend to buy, like it tends to get out of stock from the place where I buy and, and more so I often buy it on Amazon because it's the most reliable website I would say. Flipkart, I don't know much about it but uh, Amazon is a pretty great site if you want to uh, just buy art stuff. I would highly recommend Amazon instead of Flipkart because I don't know, sometimes my orders get cancelled, I don't know why but I think Amazon is a pretty great site and Oak uh, Tree Hopper it was something that I I got attracted to like I liked the kind of colors it had and and I really liked the pop of like pastel blue color it had and I wanted to portray it very nicely and and uh, then again I wanted to do an unboxing video for my new camera I bought uh, it's it's just uh, uh, what I had uh, been planning on buying and I was planning on doing an unboxing video previously I have been saving up saving up for uh, buying a camera or a decent one because because uh, uh, previously I had been filming everything on my phone so I just wanted to have a pretty decent one so I just went ahead and saved up some money and just bought myself a camera and it's kind of difficult if you are working with a camera because I am actually having problem placing a camera for recording video and stuff. I do have a tripod but uh, it doesn't tend to like hold uh, the camera because it's a DSLR and it's kind of tripod is not heavy enough to counterbalance the weight of it. So I just don't want to fall it off so I've actually used a stack of books for placing my uh, camera and you can see the way uh, it is looking like uh, it's not an overhead shot it's uh, from like the front so you can just uh, judge for yourself and yeah that's and I think uh, this camera is working very well uh, for my art videos and I think I'll be recording pretty much from this camera because it's a nice one and it's pretty decent and overall I think I really like using it a lot and I don't have much to say I would uh, just let you enjoy the whole process and I'll meet you in the
use it with my uh, sketch drawing uh, whatever you call it but it's just I just loved a gouache and I think I'll be doing uh, some more sketches uh, and paintings with this and uh, it was actually morning when I actually filmed it uh, it's just plain daylight uh, which you are seeing on camera and uh, it turned out to be pretty nice and uh, pretty nice the way it, uh, I wanted it to be and I didn't use a masking tape because I was out of supplies but I think it turned out to be nice and the oak tree hopper was pretty nice and I hope you guys like this video do subscribe like and share if you can that would really help me a lot and thanks for watching